All right, guys, now we're going to do this problem, which says that the force acting on the gear tooth is 20 pounds. So this force is 20 pounds. We solve this force into two components acting along A and B, these two lines. This is an important problem if you're going to get into mechanical engineering. So basically what you got to do is you got to divide these two forces into an A component and a B component. So to do that, we got to form a triangle. So we just are going to continue this force right here, same force, F. And we got the A component, which is going to be a force same in this way. And the B component is going to be a force same in this way. But we're going to move this force over here to form a parallelogram. So it's going to be something like this. Let me erase it so I make it more. Yeah, just like that. So you should be able to see the parallelogram. And this is the triangle. So this triangle, I'm going to redraw it over here. This is the A component of the force. This is the force. And this is the B component of the force. Now, we know that this angle is 60 degrees. See this angle right here? Same as this angle right here. It's the angle that it forms between the two. 60 degrees. And we know that the force is 20 pounds. And we also know that this one is 80 degrees. Therefore, this one is 80 degrees. And that makes this one 80 degrees. All right? So basically, we're going to use the, oh, hold on, let me draw it on this triangle, 80 degrees. We're going to use the law signs to figure out all the components. All right. So the law of sine states that side A over sine of angle A is equal to side B over sine of angle B, which is equal to side C over sine of angle C. So this means that 20 pounds, which is F over sine of a which is this angle right here which is very easy to figure it out all you got to do is 180 minus these two angles because remember the three angles of the inside of a triangle add up to 180 that will make this 40 degrees i believe it's 60 plus 80 that's 140 plus 40 that's 180 so sine of 40 degrees is equal to the b component over sine of 60 is equal to the sorry the a component sine of 80 and all you got to do is just you know pick this side of the equation solve for b and then pick this side of the equation solve for a so we'll give you these two numbers fb is equal to 26.95 we're in pounds and FA is equal to 30.64 pounds final answer